Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration um, reading for the Gemini Sun, Moon and Rising for um, the third week of August. This week is um, begins from the 13th until the 19th and I want to say to each and every person, thank you for being here, thank you for being back, thank you for the wonderful support, likes and shares um it is a week of fire all over again it is a week of passion it's a week of fire okay on monday we have a water energy on tuesday we have um the six of pentacles help is coming in on thursday we have the four of cups on on friday we have the six of swords a lot of people are going to decide to end situation i'm seeing a lot of you air people doing that now Friday is going to be a very good day because the energy of the nine of Pentacles is coming in Saturday a wonderful day two of cups is here which meaning two people are going to be connected now this is positive because someone is going to be receiving help to connect two people together and this is going to be good because whatever a regret was about something um, the regret is no longer um, you're going to be connecting with um, two people that is going to be helping you out okay then we have the energy of the four of cups whatever the situation is or was that was transpired the energy of the king of cups is here so some of you are also um, going to decide to remove yourself from a situation that has to do with the king of cups okay whatever the situation is and whatever that is happening or whatever that is transpiring you're going to decide to move yourself away from the king of cups okay so let's look at this week and let's try and see what is happening some of you who are dealing with someone who is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion it can be a man or a woman whatever the situation is this person is um, in the the reverse so this person is working on um, their um, lower energies um, their shadow side okay and it's all about money whatever the situation is this person is um, very shallow they're all about money they're all about the materialistic and um, it is as, as if they want something it's as if they want um, materialistic gains and this is why they decide to connect with you in whatever way so be careful um, you guys need to be really careful if you are about to start a relationship or get in a marriage or a relationship with someone who is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion beware of this person because this person is not um, in the relationship for love they are just there for money okay so let's see what is happening uh-huh you guys need to make a decision you guys need to make a decision because you're connecting with a Pisces cancer or Scorpion person and they're not in the relationship for the right things it's all about the money so be careful what is happening and what you're doing because this person is about to take everything that you have okay so be aware of the situation and what is transpiring then we are seeing a situation where there's help that is coming in some of you are going to be connecting um, with um, other people and they are going to be helping you to resolve a situation that was um, a, a, was um, you've had um, some issues getting this situation resolved and um, you are going to be connecting um, some of you are going to be realizing that people are coming in it could be family members because I'm seeing like a heart of love saying you know don't go ahead with this marriage don't go ahead with this person because they're all um, there for the gains of money don't go um, further in this relationship okay and this is it it's all about the money for them okay and um, whatever is transpiring and whatever is happening it's, it's not love they have no love it's you know they're being nice and 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 being nice and behaving as if but it's, it's, it's all about the money they want they 
are in it just for the money be aware of this and be careful of this because um, there's a lot of emotional um, energies that are here and um, you know you Gemini's I always say you know I love you Gemini's but whoever these um, water sign people can be when they're sweet and nice they can be a, a, be very loving very positive but whatever they're on their negative forms um, they're working really on a negative forms whoever these people are keep them away from you because um, it's not nice um, for people to just connect to a deal for money um, there is love and there is love of people who are seeing this and are going to be helping you to help uh, to come out of a situation okay um, as we look we have the four of cups in reverse which is in a good place because it's in the reverse form and some of you have some regrets that has to do in the past with um, the king of cups and you're going to decide to remove yourself from that situation now the help that is going to come in is the eye princess okay the eye princess is going to come in um, whatever reason the eye princess came in and whatever reason the eye princess is here it is as if um, whatever the situation is or was whatever that has transpired it's as if the eye princess is coming in to show you something the eye princess is coming in to show you something okay so um, it could be that the king of cups is uh, letting you be aware of a situation and it's coming in um, to let you be aware of a situation something that has transpired okay let's see what is going to be the outcomes for the situation um, with the uh, yeah this 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 no whoever is about to get in a relationship with someone between the ages of 25 and 40 40 don't do it okay this person as I said before is just in the relationship for money it's jealous it's eight it's not there there is no love if you realize that the energy of the love is in the weekend two of cups and the king of cups okay um, don't get in a relationship because it's all don't even get married because they're going to take you for everything let's see what is happening with the four of Pentacles because obviously there's going to be a lot of luck coming in for you guys okay um, some of you are going to be receiving help from if it's not your family is as if this person is a friend this person is a friend that is going to be helping you it's as if two persons is going to be um, coming to you and said listen we love you so much that we don't want to see you get so caught up in a situation like this so we you know we are really here for you and we want to make sure that you're okay and they want to bring you out of this situation okay and um, you have really some luck coming in these two cards together is saying that this is surprise luck that is about to come in because you can see um, this energy of the negative energy of um, a lot of hate and jealousy that has been taken place and it's all about money some hate and jealousy that have been taken place and it's all about money and as you see you have your outcomes is a seven of swords and the energy of the seven of swords is always um, that people try to get away with something and it has to do with whoever that woman or a man was um, that is in the reverse form because obviously they're working on their low energies that means they have a lot of jealousy and hate and and and, and you know that sort of a thing um, you can see there that they are the one who either steal something or try to get away with something or did something but it's going to be balanced out because what you're seeing here happening is the energy of luck coming in unexpected luck is coming in and this unexpected luck is coming from um, the eye princess so it could be if your father or if if your father is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion it's as if they're going to be helping you to pull yourself out of this situation um, because obviously some of you are going to decide to leave this relationship that you're in because um, it's as if your father is going to say um, you know 
just leave that behind and come home and obviously there is a lot of love um, you know if your father is a is a Pisces cancer or scorpion your father is going to help you it's as if your mother or your father if your mom is no longer there a hold a sister or a brother or some family member is going to be helping you to um, get you out of a negative situation and a negative um, situation and you're going to be overcoming this because you have the ace of swords which um, justice you stand up and this is going to be helping a lot okay let's see what exactly that was seven of sword what exactly that was stolen let's see the energy of the seven of sword what exactly that was stolen um, okay so as usual I change up the readings so um, we're looking at your outcomes of this week okay so we're looking here at um, the Queen the King and Queen of Cups okay the King and Queen of Cups now this energy is as if some of you your parents because it's a two is the eye princess comes out twice this is also the energy of um, also the energy of what is happening with this situation obviously some of you parents could be um, a Pisces cancer or scorpion and here is the energy of the three of Pentacles they are trying to help you to return to you something that was stolen okay because um, these are people who are helping you from the spirit world these are people who are helping you from the spirit world because here we are we have the seven of swords and we have the king and the um, the two is always this is happening the two of cups okay so here we also have the two of cups so we have a double so um, number two is going to be duality and for you guys use the two because here we have another two so we have the two of cups coming up twice here so obviously this is about a relationship some of you are in a relationship that is not a healthy relationship um, and if your parents have passed away your parents from out the spirit world is going to release you from this relationship because they are right above the energy of health so obviously you can see with energy of the snake and the jealousy and all that stuff that is going on um, with a seven so obviously there was money that was stolen okay money that was stolen or money that is about to st to stolen and it's as if they're trying to return it to you because here is the energy of uh, um, the two of cups and the two of cups is here twice so this is um, your guides and angels from out the spirit world which is basically helping you because the energy of the moon is always about the psychic it's always about the other side that is helping you so you're receiving some of you are receiving help from your spirit guides from the other side to help to return something now this this energy of the moon um, here and we're going to ask about that because you have such a, uh, a beautiful reading and it's it's, it's it's an help situation because they're in the form of the psychic it's not really that is the energy they're in the form of the psychic and they're working together with you to return what was stolen so it's actually a beautiful a beautiful reading so ladies and gentlemen I want to say to you guys I'm wishing you a wonderful week a wonderful week um, namaste until next week